Hey, check this out, y'all. That's not my trailer, but look what I found. I asked him, I said, what you about to do with that wood? Because I thought he was taking it home for himself. He said, I'm taking it to Rumpke to dump it. I'm like, dump it in my yard. Those will make excellent chairs in the yard. I got logs now to sit on. He said they're heavy and he has more wood. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to see if I can't start making stuff, chairs and stuff. He said he'll drop it off anytime. When he brings wood like this, that's good. And here it is. He's about to dump the first load of wood for me. He said it's heavy and I got to move it with Penny. So I want to see this dump feature because my YouTube subscribers are going to want me to get a trailer like this one day. They will want me to, I'm sure. I need to learn this. I want a dump, a, a dump bed badly. Tell you what, man, this was old and rusted. And you fixed it? Oh yeah. I never $2, thought about $2, that. Man, and I got it sandblasted, painted. How much did it cost you to, re, uh, to bring it back to life? 2,600. So, so how much do you think you, oh, you said in total? So. It was, it was really, I should have took it before and after pictures, but it's, it's amazing what a good job you did on it. I get all my stuff up at Smith Trailer. That's where I got my trailer from. This one right here. Yep, see? Smith Trailer. I've been dealing with them for 30 years, man. They're great, great people. Yeah. I, I bought I bought three trailers from them in total. But this is the first enclosed I ever got. And then I bought a tractor that was too big for it. But I only have a minivan, so I don't have anything that's big enough to carry. Oh, those are big. Yeah. And see, this is the thing. These are the type of logs I'm never going to be able to burn in one sitting. I could drill holes in it, though, and then burn like that if I wanted to. These are huge. I can drag that one. It's the heaviest. That one will make a good log. Like, I, if I cut across like this, if I can find some way to cut across it and notch into it, I can make that like a bench. But you're going to need a lot bigger saw. Definitely. You know, I'll go buy one. But you can. You'll give me a reason to have one. You're definitely going to give me a reason to have a, a bigger saw now. You put a chainsaw in a man's hand, he'll cut all the That's what I'm saying. <laughs> when they already cut down, it's a lot easier to cut them up. <laughs> yeah we got some wood yeah i don't know what i'm gonna do with it but i like that Ooh, those are big oh my goodness these boys are huge this one is dangerous wow that is massive Oh my goodness, I got some some wood to cut up, y'all. I'm gonna just chip away at it and cut little pieces off at a time and just throw them in the, oh wow. Yeah, when the boys get home and they see this. Yeah, we got some wood. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I never had. <laughs> Your boy be finding work for Penny. Yes, he do. Don't worry about it, just drop it on out. Good to go. Everything's out. Yes, it is. Hey, I tell you, you're going to be much lighter getting out of here than you came in. You don't have to worry about getting stuck now. Hey, that's a lot of wood. Wow. Your boy needed wood. But he got a lot of wood. Wow. Hey. When they said it was going to bring me more, I wasn't expecting this much. Hey, there's some big wood right here. Bro, what am I going to do with all this? There's a lot of wood. Wow. Hey, ask and you shall receive. That's a lot of wood. Log number one. Only 
200 more to go. 